Hello everybody, Princess Bear here, and we're back at the Ayapa Expo here at the Orange County Convention Center because the princess has had a lot of time to play. I've only had a little bit of time to play. He's been jelly. I have been very jelly. jelly, so let's go see what amazing things we can find on the show floor. Be sure to subscribe. You heard the girl. And remember to have fun. Always. Where did you go? It's not vegan, is it? Yeah. I didn't think so. Mm. Waffles like, mmm, smells very Belgian. Ooh, that's very good. Mmm. I'm gonna eat a lot today, I see. That's great, that's excellent. Birthday cake? Birthday cake is probably not vegan. I'm gonna go with something safe. Blue raspberry. Texture's so weird. I mean, something you can't have then. My pina colada. Birthday cake. Princess loves cake. Fun little cup. Super inexpensive. Just ice and flavoring. Tastes like um like I'm at the movie theater eating a slushie. It's so perfect. This is the right kind of like ice too. It's not like um I don't know. It's just it's the right kind of ice. The right kind of shape. It's really good. So I have the birthday cake flavor because the princess can't have that one. And some one of us has to eat our cake and eat it too. We heard about these in the beverage uh, the beverage panel yesterday that sort of creating like those like experiences instead of the like the actual drink that people care about. They'll pay for a gimmick. We pay for gimmicks. All the time. Oh. This is like cake better ice cream, which I can't have, and like shaved ice form. I love that. I'm so glad I can't share. You're all in the kitchen. I like to take this with me everywhere. Hmm? I like to take this with me everywhere. No, I do not. Imagine having to clean this. But everything looks like pretty standard. You got all like the vents and everything else. Very nice in here. Hey, all right, yourself? So this is the Flavor Blaster. It works like a smoking gun. We have a selection of 19 different... We have a selection of 19 different ones. Currently in this one I have citrus. So if you want to give that a smell, you'll be able to get some citrus notes coming from there. So I can use it as a normal smoking gun right now. But once I dip it into the mixture, place it over a drink, pull the trigger, you get a beautiful aromatic filled bubble. And then are you ready for the pop? Yeah. Three, two... Wow. Well, once more, Show in like time. Like <laughs> there you go. I'm very good. You finally decided to come over. Yes. I think vegan also. Well, I mean, the food, it's all They're natural, so the food coloring is. It's like vegetable black oil. Uh, it's, yeah, it's all natural. We use cane sugar. Black, for sweet. Black. Yeah, I'll try the uh, black. Really no preservatives. Um, Cosmo! This glass one is going to be twelve dollars. Oh yeah, it's nice and fruity. You can absolutely taste the vodka, but it's not too strong. It's nice and balanced. Yeah. I mean, yeah, this is good. You can definitely take this to your room and drink it. Whoa. I'm usually worried about like pre-mixed drinks being like really sugary or like artificial. Oh no, it's like fresh made. That is amazing. And we have a regular margarita. <laughs> oh, you can taste the tequila, but it's really light. It's not too strong. It's nice and floral. This is a nice, like, a flavorful margarita, more than like what you would get at like a Bacala. This is 
good. I'm definitely gonna go to the Swan and pick up a couple of these. Margarita claws. I think it's one of the better margaritas in a can that I've had. Nice seltzer, it's very light in flavor, so you, you just kind of get the little carbonation action. This is a good good installment. We never turn down white claw, I turn down white claw sometimes, but maybe this will change my mind. Ooh, that's much better. I've been told about the surge kind. I normally have the normal white claw, but the surge might be the way to go. This um, blood orange, it's quite tasty. The new um, surge blackberry. It's a little artificial tasting. I like the other ones better. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life. I'm ashamed, there's no time. You're the wooden coaster lover, aren't you? Wooden coasters are my favorite. Ghost Rider at Knott's Berry Farm. That's my jam. Expo in Orlando, Florida. I literally came to put my ear over here. <laughs> Take them down for a hurricane, but yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a much better idea. Yeah. Much better idea. Yeah. Now we have had them go through northeasterns with uh, high winds and uh -huh. that kind of thing. And this is great for like Texas because a lot of the trees froze down there, mm -hmm. so this is a. Uh, Are they like just anchored, or how do you how do you keep them around? Uh, we have a base plate on these things, uh, but normally uh, the trees have like a pipe that goes out of the uh, the bottom of the tree. Uh -huh. And then we'll provide a sleeve pipe, and that gets concrete into the ground, and then okay. the tree will slide right into the sleeve pipe. Okay. So then, if you do take it out, you just take it out of the sleeve pipe, and yeah, yeah, it's very cool. Thank you. Thank I you. appreciate it. In the fog, we're back at Halloween Horror Nights. Oh, we're gonna get for now. Oh, All it the year. smells like Halloween Horror Nights. Three, two, one, go! Chairs, don't you? I do love a good set of chairs. It's very nice. Very nice. Zip lining? Yeah. You're down to zip line? I never should have gone zip lining. Woo! Shock about.
They wanna say my name, but they holding back. They wanna say they hate, but they know it's cap. I ain't play no games, I just do that's fact, and I don't feel no shame. It's a mood you lack, I go crazy. Nah, bitch, I ain't lazy. Track after track, I work on the shit daily. Pass me the jack, right as fuel got me hazy. About to unpack all these shit I've been chasing. I've got visions in my head, like memories after death. To be a legend instead of something you can forget. I'm living up every breath, I'd rather leave them be led. I'll fill the seeds as I spread with every word that I've said. Somewhere, so um, cotton candy soft serve, but that's all the bear gets. I don't really get cotton candy from that. I get candy, but not like cotton candy, it doesn't have like, like super sweet, like the concentrated sugar of like cotton candy. Yeah. Probably should have got the dole whip. They try to hand this to the princess. I need more of these vendors to start thinking about vegan things. It's like, I want to know from any of them, we haven't just talked too many, is are they thinking about more vegetarian and vegan options? Because so far, this is really the way they are. Expo 4 has been absolutely amazing. So many fun things to do, so many things to try, so many things coming about the theme park and music park industry. Yes. Definitely motivating us to start doing things in other states. Yes, I think that would be great. And also looking for more vegan options yeah, in the, other places. The, the food vendors didn't really, like, they understood vegan, but they didn't really have any, like, vegan offerings. Nobody, I don't think, is thinking about it. We want to see more of that. We would. We would like to see that. Serve our people. Convince us to come to your state with some vegan options. I know we, we looked at, what, New Jersey, Arizona. Yeah. We're down to travel. Give us a reason to. Anyway, if you guys want to see more things like this, Expo or Orlando otherwise, let us know in the comments below if there's anything else you'd like to see us do that's always the only place to find us. Hit the notification bell if you want to see other videos like this. And we have new videos five days a week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday. Yeah. We'll see you soon. Be sure to subscribe and like this video and comment so we can go to Iapa again next year. And tell your friends. You heard the girl. <laughs>